My name is David Andre and in this video I'll show you how to use Claude AI, which is one of the best AI tools right now, but most people are still not using it. So when you first go to the website, it will look something like this. You will have to create an account, which takes like 20 seconds. Once you log in, it should look something like this. Now, later in the video, I'll show you the paid plan for Claude and whether that is worth it, because it has some interesting benefits. For example, without the paid plan, you cannot really use custom interactions and you get five times more messages with Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Anyways, one cool feature is this. If you click on it, you'll see artifacts. If you've never used Claude AI, you may be like, okay, David, what are artifacts? Well, it's basically a way to visualize your code or your website. So let's say you ask a website in HTML, you don't really see what it looks like, right? With artifacts, as you can see, it creates this field on the right next to your chat, and you can see exactly what you've created and how it looks like. So I'll give you an example, right? You can say, draw a horse in SVG using artifacts. So as you can see, it's writing, and when it finishes, it will show a horse. <laughs> Look at this. This is not a good example, so let's try again. Draw a cat in SVG. Oh my god, look at this. This is so good. This is code. And the model sees it. The model knows how a cat looks like and made this. This is only one of many things Sonnet 3.5 can do. Now the next thing I want to show you is how to build an entire video game using artifacts in Claude AI. But before I do that, I want to say, it's the last two days where if you join my community, I will build a personalized custom GPT just for you. And this is, you know, advantage of ChatGPT. Cloud uh, doesn't have custom GPTs yet. Maybe they will add it. But for now, ChatGPT is the best way to get any automation, anything automated. So whether that's something in your business, something in your work, something in your life, it doesn't matter. If you join my community in the next 48 hours, because this is a June only offer, I will build you a custom GPT. And of course, you'll, on top of that, you'll get all the trainings we have inside, as well as direct access to myself in the form of a weekly call. So if that sounds interesting, make sure to join back to Claude. Now, let me show you the power of artifacts because this is only the beginning. Create a simple Space Invaders game and show it in artifacts. Boom. Let's see what Claude cooks up. So now it's programming the Space Invaders game and let's see whether we can actually play it in Artifact, because this is something that no other model can do. Okay, so we have the tutorial here. To play the game, use the left and right arrow. Oh my god, we're going. Okay, left and right arrow. To move your ship, green rectangle at the bottom of the screen. Oh, there we are, okay. Press the space bar to shoot bullets upwards. Oh my god. Guys, do you see this? Wait, my screen is coming up. I need to move my screen. Guys, this is crazy. This is insane. This is insane! AI models have built this from a single prompt. This is what I mean. If you're not using Claude 3.5 Sonnet, you're actually missing out. No other models can do this in a single prompt where you can also play the game right in the AI tool. This is only the beginning. I'm, I'm gonna show you the power of artifacts. Now code a simple Pong game in, and show it in artifacts. No other LLM has the capabilities of Claude 3.5 Sonnet. What Anthropic is doing is truly amazing. They went from a basically unknown company a year and a half ago to the leading AI research lab. I mean, right now they have the best LLM in the world. So technically they're ahead of OpenAI. Obviously OpenAI likely has something cooking in the background. Okay, let's see. How do we play this? Okay, we're playing Pong. Okay, it works. Anyways, you get the point. You can create any single game and test it right away. I didn't have to put the code into VS Code. I didn't have to do anything. If you're not a programmer, listen up because this is perhaps the most revolutionary development. Even if you have a bit of creativity, you can see the implications. You can create something and sell it on Fiverr without touching a single line of code, without even understanding what programming language you've built it in, purely because you can use AI tools. This is the power of AI. And let me show you the true power of artifacts in something that you can actually sell today, which is complete websites. Design a complete website for, uh, let's do Airbnb house, and show it in artifacts. Make it really advanced and modern looking. Let's see what Claude does. Certainly, I'll design a modern advanced looking website for Airbnb house using React components. This design will incorporate current web design trends, responsive layout, and interactive elements. And it's really writing, look at this. We have a bunch of divs, you know, hopefully it knows how to center a div. Logo in the top left. Scroll down, photo gallery, oh my God. So obviously it didn't generate the image. Look at this, icons. This is crazy. Reviews, man. How long would this take you to make manually? This is so good. This is 
Wow. Like a check-in. Working check-in form. This is actually a sellable website. Like, if you go on Fiverr and list, you can literally go on Fiverr, just list web design services and use Cloud AI to do all of it. We're talking like 200, 300, 400 bucks for a simple website. And this is a single prompt. I could... <laughs> I could do more prompts and like customize it to the way I want. Wow. I'm actually shocked. I really feel bad for people who are not seeing this video, you know. I am still using the free version of Claude. Now that I mentioned that, let me upgrade to the paid version because I'm sure many of you want to see whether it's worth it. So if we look at upgrade, we have two different options. We have the Pro. Okay, let me move my cam back to the corner. We have the Pro for 18 euros plus VAT. And the team, but keep in mind it's minimum five members so you know on chat gpt you can get the team's plan for minimum two members but five members i guess most people will probably go with the pro plan but if you have a large team you you know you might consider it so let, let's look at the benefits right for 18 euros with like 20 dollars we get five times more usage versus the free plan obviously good access to cloud free haiku the fasted model and Claude Free Opus, which honestly, this is kind of a, uh, they just throw it in there. Okay, this is important. Create projects, and I'm going to show you this. This is a new feature that is not in the free version, where you can actually set the custom instructions. So, it's basically like a project. I guess it might be the version of a GPT, but not really, because there is no GPT store. You cannot push it to the public, right? But uh, you can customize the instructions and set with docs, code, and files, which, by the way, Claude Sonnet 3.5, 200,000 context window. Now, you get priority access during high traffic periods. Now, you might say, okay, David, this is just another thing they threw on there. I would not say so, because when ChatGPT crashes, where do all the people go? Obviously, to Claude. Now, enough talking. Let me subscribe and see you on the other side. And now I'm on a professional plan. Beautiful. So, okay, let's click on the project and let's explore this feature, because this is only available on the pro plan. How to use Claude. Okay. This is an example project that's going to explain, I guess. But now you can notice we can choose other models. So maybe you don't want to use your precious Sonnet, um, you know, limit. You go to Haiku and you get super fast uh, inference. Now, this is project knowledge. Add relevant context for a project. Documents, code, other files for Claude to reference in your chats. In this example, we've added key files about how to use Claude. Okay, Claude prompting guide. So let's see. Um, tell me what's in the Claude prompting guide and it has this document which is not in the training data that's the main thing these external files whether it's pdfs uh, microsoft documents code files anything really csv files excel they are not in the training data so the model doesn't know them unless you give them so let's see the cloud prompting guide provides a detail okay be clear and specific use examples encourage thinking use it oh this is some great prompt engineering tips shout out to the prompt engineers and Tropic. I mean, yeah, by the way, if you just l remember these, these are like the basics, fundamentals of prompt engineering. And most of you are still not doing them. So listen to this advice. Anyways, uh, let's try it with our own project. So let's click on projects, create a new project. All right. We're going to name it um, Coding Assistant, right? And let's see. Um, I need help uh, understanding and debugging code. Oops create project. So now here we have the custom instructions. This is important. This is what we cannot do on the free version. And that's basically a system prompt. You know, inside of ChatGPT, if you build a custom GPT, it's the instructions. In code, in any API, it's called a system prompt. So here we can say like, um, you know, respond always in full caps, only use third grade English. Okay, begin every response with a joke obviously these are not serious custom instructions but now that i mention it it's gonna do it so even if i say like um let's give it an external file shall we okay so here is the agent i've built in one of the recent videos with docker and as you can see one <laughs> one percent of knowledge size used i guess that's the context window yeah okay so this is super good actually wow this is super good it, sh it shows you how much of the context window you are using and then we have the python file here agents.py 100 lines of code so let's see uh help me understand what this python file does now if you notice something i am typing with plenty of typos that doesn't matter it's a language model it can understand it doesn't see it as words it sees it as tokens so you're chilling never correct your words that's just a waste of time okay <laughs> as you can see it indeed is following the custom instructions it is responding in full caps 
It started with a joke. Why did the computer go to the doctor? It had a virus. Haha. <laughs> okay. The Python file contains new data. It reads a CSV file. Makes more rows like it. Here's what it does. Okay, yeah. It definitely responds in third grade English. Let's do something different. Let's feed it an entire book. So I'm going to create a new project. I'm going to do book summarizer. I want to learn books 10 times faster than people who don't use AI tools. Okay. Great project. And let's do something... Okay, so this is interesting. I put in a book that has 700 pages, and actually this is too long. We have to do a smaller book, $100 million offers by Alex Ormosi. This is a still very large file, but as you can see, 37% uh, used. This one is 138 pages. So we can ask this one. Okay, let's, let's say I have an AI community, which I do, which lessons from this book could be relevant to my business uh, let's see what it does so now it's uh, thinking deeply which means it's reading the entire file it's reading the 300 uh, i mean 137 pages which would take you a human two days i mean i don't know i'm a slow reader but yeah maybe it would took you like three four hours if you're a fast reader but let's see based on the context of 100 million offers by alex ormosi here are three highly relevant lessons that could help you, your AI community. Obviously, I, I read the book, amazing book. But if I hadn't, there is no faster way than get the lessons of a 137 book than using Claude. Like, and you're getting the best LLM in the world. Keep in mind that. It's not just about the context window. You're using the smartest LLM to summarize it. So, creating a grand sum offer. The book emphasizes the importance of creating an offer compelling. For your AI community, you could bundle various AI-related services, resources, and exclusive content into a... Sounds like something we're doing. Hmm. Yeah, that's exactly what we're doing in the community. Plus, again, this is a June only offer. So you have like the last 48 hours to join the community if you want a custom GPT. And look, this is a Grand Slam offer. We also offer a 100% money back guarantee. So if you don't find the community useful, I'll send your money back. And on top of that, you get exclusive access to myself in the form of a weekly call, as well as all the other trainings and access to over 500 people at the cutting edge of AI. So if that sounds interesting to you, and if you want me to build you a custom GPT for anything you want, make sure to join. It's the first link in the description. Thank you for watching.